Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to set up a Shishi Odeshi fountain. Shishi Odeshi is a Japanese fountain and it's also known as a deer chaser. The name originated from, uh, from the historical applications where Japanese rice farmers used it for, for distracting away the beast like deers and uh, birds from their farm. Modern day applications of this fountain is that it's used as a classic uh, garden water feature and it's also used in uh, meditation centers. It's also found in uh, a lot of uh, Japanese tea gardens and its main purpose when it's used in a Japanese tea garden is that it's used as a spiritual cleansing element so people usually wash their hands before they enter the meditation center for ceremonies outside you know outside the Japanese tea garden uh, the installation and setup of this Shishi Odishi also known as deer chaser fountain is uh, fairly easy and I'm going to show you how to do that what you need is a bamboo fountain kit a Shishi Odishi bamboo fountain kit and you can get that from tabletop fountain store uh, it includes a base uh, of actual bamboo spouts and a water pump. You you get all three of them from tabletopfountainstore.com. You need a, a waste. You can get a waste from Lowe's. This waste cost me about uh, twenty dollars, and it's about twenty inches wide. You know you can get there are a lot of different kinds of varieties, so you can get get your own type when you go to waste. Just just make sure that it's not too deep. If it's too deep, then uh, you may use uh, a base of your own to cover it, to support it, support the fountain and you will see in a minute why I use my own base. So uh, you start off with a, a, a bowl that is not too deep and if it's deep enough you uh, use a base. This is just a tile that I had in my garage so I'm using that. I'm, I'm putting it in as a base and uh, I'm gonna set up the Sishi or Dishi fountain in, in a minute. I use this base here and I uh, I just plug this one in here. It's pretty straightforward. You go in here, and this one goes in here. And there we go. We have we have it all set. Now, this is the pipe, the tubing that actually circulates the water. By the way, this waste is filled with water, and it's just going to recirculate the water. So I'm going to put the waste. I'm going to put the tubing uh, in the water, and I'm going to connect the pump to the tubing. So there we go, it's connected and I'm going to put the pump inside the water. It's all set and I just need to, uh, by the way this, you need to plug this one in too. So it's all set here and now I just need to plug in the water pump. So there we go, I plug in the pump and it started circulating the water. The water is going into the horizontal spout for now. You can uh, decorate this one with uh, river stones. I got this from Michael's. I'm just going to put that in here. Just to create a zen appeal. It looks very, very decorative when you have this kind of fountain. Also, I got my little flowering plants that I'm going to put in this uh, vase as well. I got this from, uh, from my local nursery. And you can just put them in here, on this side, one on here, and one on this side, just to cover up the tubing and whatnot. And we are all set. This is a, a tabletop shishi or deshi fountain. You can use this indoors, or you can use it outdoors, wherever you prefer. Just make sure that you get the plants accordingly, because some of the flowering plants may not survive indoors. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, if you want to learn more about uh, Shishi Odishi, please visit uh, tabletopfountainstore.com. Thank you. So just so you know, this is how a typical uh, Shishi Odishi works. It goes back up and forth and it makes a soft clacking sound when it hits the uh, base. You will see it in a second.